not just drop the cap? Fuck! Where is the cap? On the cap. Shit. I just fucked my whole intro, but I was gonna like scare y'all. I was gonna be like, last kiss, your boy Bell's back in the video, but nah, it's fucking. Fucking bullshit water. Anyway, guys, say, guess what it is? My birthday! Yay! Yeah, so cool, I'm turning 19 today, and I'm going crazy. I'm not officially 19 yet. Hey, see the time. F -O -F -O -F fucking. No, it ain't gonna. It ain't gonna. No, okay, cool. But yeah, guys, at 319 today, I'll be officially 19. I ain't 19 yet. It is, it is the day of my birthday, but it's not officially like my birthday. You know what I'm Like at 319, I'll be officially. So it passes. So you guys have seen this like before my birthday because I'm uploading this. I'm doing this at the night before. So, you know, when it's 319, I'll already, the video won't be out yet. So, you know, it, it's a, it's pretty much a birthday when I'm uploading this, you know. So, you know, 19 years on this plan is pretty, pretty, pretty crazy. And this year has been a crazy year. You know, it started off as, you know, Pretty shit, <laughs> and then it got better as the year has gone on. So you know, I mean, I'm doing well now, uh, and I'm excited to see what the future holds. You know, I'm 19 years old, I'm not 20 yet, I'm not old as fuck yet, but I am getting old, and it's kind of sad. But it is what it is, life. So yeah, college has been pretty sick. You know, I mean, I can't wait to you know continue on and get, and get my new part, my own place next year, because next year I'm gonna get my own apartment, and you guys are gonna see everything that happens after I get my apartment. I'm gonna be making a lot more videos. I'm I'm gonna do a, I'm gonna do a schedule, an upload schedule. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to see how long this goes for. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Three three videos a week at five o'clock. I'll upload them. I'm hoping I can keep it for a long time. Uh, what are those videos gonna consist? Um, whatever. These probably uh, Wednesdays are gonna be like more like face videos, like I'm showing you guys my face, like doing stuff. And then Monday is gonna be like me like commenting or something. And Friday, it's either gonna be music or it's gonna be something else. And also, by the way, I got a new song coming out uh, on Friday, uh, Thursday 11. Uh, me and Michael, we it's like a long, it's an old song that we made, but I'm gonna go and drop it. Uh, and uh, here's a sneak peek of the song real quick. You know, it's gonna come out at 11 p.m. on uh, Central Time, by the way. So here it is. Space out, yeah. Mind on my hypocrites, yeah. Wasting time, yeah. We ain't doing none of that shit, yeah. Space out, yeah. Ball and see what's happening, yeah. Quiet in the clutch, I ain't worried about the shit, yeah. Letting go, yeah. Just letting go, oh. Letting go, yeah. Just letting go, yeah. Letting go, yeah. Just letting go, oh. Letting go, yeah. Just letting go, oh. Letting go, I ain't no average doe, oh. Well. Gotta dodge, but no demon, that's so cold, well. Breaking bad. Yeah, let it go. Anyway, guys, so um, we're gonna get to the quiz. So I'm gonna be doing a quiz today for this video. I'm gonna be finding out if this website can guess the month I was born in. So guys, if you guys know, obviously, um, it's October, so I should be born October, right? If my birthday's in October, the month's October. Yeah, okay. So yeah, I was born in October. So if this actually gets October, that'd be pretty sick, but I guarantee it won't. It's not gonna get October. But it's gonna ask me a few questions. Like I said, 10 questions, I think I said 10 questions. It's gonna ask me about, uh, you know, just my life. So we're gonna answer them and we'll see if he gets the right birthday. So the first question here we got, what's one word that shows uh, how your friends just would describe you as? Now, I would like to think my friends describe me as funny, probably shy. I think shy is how people would describe me as at, at first. At first, I don't really talk, talk to people that much at the beginning. But as you get to know me, I get a lot more talkative, talkative and a lot more funny because my jokes, you know, my jokes are a lot better as you know you get to know me. So, <sighs> ego boost, guys. Come on, my ego. I have to boost my ego. I'm funny. I have to go funny. I'm sorry, guys. I have my ego boost. Okay, I apologize. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Next question. Favorite artist. Favorite artist. So we got T-Pain. We got Akon. We got Jesse. We got Beyonce, the queen of everything. Uh, Dave, I don't know who that is. Cold, uh, Coldplay, definitely. Coldplay's my favorite, you know what I'm saying? Nah. Kanye, the Goat West, you know what I'm saying? Britney Spears, she slaps. Her music slaps. Uh, Rihanna, yeah, she's pretty good. T.I., I don't listen to a lot of his music. Flo Rida is a banger. Flo Rida definitely bangs. Jonas Brothers, not even gonna say anything about that because I'm just gonna get a full-on roast session. Ooh, it's here between Kanye or Flo Rida on this one. I think I'm gonna go with Kanye. All right, we'll go Kanye now. We'll go Kanye, Kanye, Kanye. All right, favorite food. Okay, so I eat, I eat pretty much mostly. Okay, Mexican food. I eat a shit ton of Mexican food. Fajitas, tacos. I mean, everyone eats tacos, so it's pretty much the same. Um, what else do I eat? Burritos, something like that. You know, all that shit. You know, the basic Mexican food. You know, you guys are growing up. All the Mexicans in my watch this video are probably like, oh, that's not all. It's Mexican food because it's more than just that. Yeah, no, I know, but that's <laughs> that's all I eat. French, French fries, French bread. Uh, American food, nah, I, know, I don't eat American food, I don't, nah, bro, nah, 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 Italian, yeah, pasta, ooh, you know, ooh, yes, 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 uh, tropical, I don't, I don't eat tropical food, why, because, 
just just haven't got around to it. Indian food, uh, I puked the last time I ate Indian food. That shit trash. But if you like Indian food, I'm not judging you. I'm just saying I will not like it. Chinese food, not really a big fan. <laughs> Japanese food, we'll go move on from that. But it's it's Mexican food, guys. It's Mexican food. I out out of those besides American food, because I'm not gonna be boring. I'm gonna pick uh, Mexican food. Oh yeah, cómo estás, Tuvian? Oh. Your type of movies. Ooh. This is the easy one for me. It's either comedy, action, uh, horror, or if I'm with a girl, like if I'm on a date with a girl, I'll do romance. I'll do a romance movie, but I mean, I prefer a comedy or action. I'm just, that's just me. Um, I, besides that, yeah, that's that's pretty much it. It's either comedy or uh, action. For books, I don't read. <laughs> I don't read. Is there an option for that? There is. Thank God. Because I don't read. I don't read any books. That's why you're so fucking retarded, Chris. Hey, if that's if that's the reason why, then she. What do you think of your family? Oh, here we go. Personal questions. Oh yeah, you guys get to know a little bit about me, huh? My family's pretty great. My family's great. You know, I don't really talk to them as much as a lot of other kids probably talk to families. I don't really open up to them as much as y'all probably do to y'all's families. But I still love them. They love me. You know, they support me. So it is what it is. Uh, as long as I don't make physical contact. Oh wait. What do you think of your wait? I'm retarded. Uh oh, retard alert. Retard alert class! As long as I don't make physical contact in front of my friends, I'm fine. Man, you're embarrassed front man, you can't be I don't I'm not embarrassed from my parents my parents from my friends. I don't care. It is what it is. I'd rather suffer a long, painful death for any of them. I am very close to my family. Jesus Christ. If I had a choice to go on a family vacation with my friends, I'd choose my friends. That's probably what that's probably mine. I'm not saying I wouldn't go on a vacation with my family, because I definitely 100% would. It's just if I had to cho choose between friends or family to go on vacation with, I'd choose friends. I sometimes don't want to leave the house. I love them too much. You're a fucking loser. <laughs> You're a fucking loser. Who, like, do you really? Come on, bro. I turn down my friends all the time just to be my family. Okay, that's sent back out there. Oh no, I'm screwed. <laughs> I never talk to them. I can't stand them. Well, shit. <laughs> that, that's tough. That's tough. I can't grab my knees on that one. <laughs> so thankful for my family. Without them, I, who am I? Exactly. I mean, that's pretty much all of our answer. I'm not going to pick that, but that's that's a very good answer for all of us. You know, who we, we wouldn't be exist if it wasn't for our parents. Let's just be honest. Yes, let's, let's hope I do something fun with them today. I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah, I hope, I wish to do some fun things with them every single day, you know, I don't turn down opportunities when, like, they, uh, gave them to me, it's like, hey, Chris, you wanna come hang out with us? I'm like, yeah, if I'm playing play PS4, you know, I'm not an addict on the, the video games, but, like, you know, if I have an opportunity to hang out with my family, I'm gonna take it most of the time. So, out of all of these, I would probably pick the vacation one, just cause it's the most reasonable for me, I would, that's probably what I would do, compared to all the other ones. What's your top strength? My top strength, ooh, here we go. I don't have any strengths. Well, shit, you're a fucking loser. Loyalty, that's probably one. I don't like to brag, but I'm very attractive. If you pick that, you're a fucking, you're fucking ugly, I guarantee it. Not you. I'm drop dead gorgeous. Oh God, why didn't anybody tell me? <laughs> I am a believer. A believer of what? Of God? If that's the case, that's a strong one. That's a very strong one. If... If it's like a believer yourself, then hey, that's good too. I'm good at sports. I'm decent, I guess. I'm pretty decent. I mean, you know, I play JV basketball, so I mean, you know, I guess that's I guess that's something. <laughs> I get all A's and still keep up with my social life. I get A's and B's and sometimes C's. Sometimes C's. You know, I'm an A and B student. You know, I'm pretty damn good. Um, when I try, <laughs> I can spell better than no. I can't. I cannot spell nothing. You guys, if you're if you know me, you know I cannot spell. I have to use Siri for everything. Trust me. It's kind of embarrassing now. I really, really, I am. I'm really, really smart. I, you guys can tell. I just misread that sentence. I'm not very smart, as you guys can tell. I am an achiever. I mean, I like to achieve things, but I'm not, you know, a full out outgoing achiever, you know. I'm good at making friends. I'm decent. I'm pretty decent at making good friends. Making friends. You know, that's probably the one I'm gonna pick. Relationship with my parents. Ooh, you guys get to see some some good ones. I keep secrets all the time and they never find out. No, my parents find out. <laughs> they find out a lot of secrets I have. I tell them everything and they support me. I, I tell them nothing. I tell my parents absolutely nothing. Not like just you know, just to be a, a dick, but you know, I just I just don't do it. Why? I probably should. I probably should do it more, so I will. They support me, but they know nothing about my social life. That's probably the one I'm gonna pick. That's 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 hundred percent true. They support me no matter what I do, it's just they know nothing about me. Cause I don't tell them nothing. Uh they only know they, I've 
they've only known two of my relationships, you know, girl wise. They only they only know about two of my relationships I've been in. Cause well, they they pretty much like kind of like knew about it. Like, oh, I see you texting a girl. I'm like, yeah, I'm in a relationship. So fuck. You know what I'm saying? I lied to them all the time, but they never realized. No, no, I lie a lot, and they still somehow figured it. Uh, we barely communicate because I'm up in my room all the time. That would be true if it wasn't for the last part. Um, I'm not I'm not in here a lot. I'm usually out with my friends partying or just hanging out or doing. I'm out of the house a lot, so I'm not in this room a ton. You know, I'm I'm in, well, and when I'm in this room, I'm either doing YouTube, uh, gaming on my on YouTube, or doing something else that you guys know. I don't do that every single day. Anything to do with them, and they aren't concerned. Well, shit, you fucking school shooter. I, I be, I lie about everything, but never works. I think I'm gonna go with they support me, but they know nothing about my social life. That's probably the best answer choice right there. Boyfriend girlfriend status. Ooh, here we go. Uh, I could never have a boyfriend girlfriend because I'm too close of a friends with most of them. Man, you gotta branch out, bro. You can't just be trying to date your friends. You gotta go out and get some random girls. You know what I'm saying? I, I've dated a few of my friends, but like. A few of the girlfriends, not my my two friends. Don't get that. Don't get twisted. I'm single and hating it. I don't hate it. I'm not. I don't hate being single. It's just it is what it is. You know. I'm single at the moment. I like to get in relationships that are actually real. You know what I'm saying? To get into actual relationships, not just jump into a relationship whenever I want. You know. I like to get into actual relationships that will last. I have more than ten boyfriends slash girlfriends a year. Damn, you freaking hoe. <laughs> I've had a boyfriend or girlfriend for over a year. Hey, like I said, hey, congratulations if you could get there past a year. So if you do get a relationship past a year, just make sure you keep that person. You know, because if you guys fail, it's going to be a miserable breakup. I'm telling you, it's going to be a miserable breakup. Ooh, it's not going to look good on your Snapchats. Ooh, you, I don't have the guts to stick it out with someone long enough. Well, Jesus Christ, you're a hoe. <laughs> if you can't stick with one person, you like Blueface. You a hoe. That's tough. I've been, I don't, I don't want a boyfriend slash girlfriend. Hey, if you don't want one, go right ahead. But you know, hey, if you, if you are looking for a relationship and then you're single, hit me up. You know what I'm saying? My Snapchat's ChrisChun9. You know, swipe up and you know, come, come, you know, come for your boy. Come. I, I've been happy with my partner, but they don't feel the same way. Well, that's tough. That's tough. You know, so hit that bitch like, <laughs> I don't condone violence. I, that was a joke, okay? I don't don't go beat your wife slash boyfriend, okay? Don't do it. But I only date when I feel my partner feels the same way about me as I do about them. I'm very cautious. That is true. I am very cautious about who I get into relationships with. Relationships in middle school are very, 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 very fucking stupid. <laughs> yeah, they're in my opinion, they're very stupid. The first freaking one is stupid. They break someone's heart in the end all the time anyways. Most relationships do anyway. Most relationships will break someone's heart more than the other. But yeah, definitely, especially in middle school, because have you seen middle school or Snapchats? Oh my god, they're so cringe. <laughs> they're so cringe. Don't talk to me. I'm depressed, okay? If you know who, if you really know me, you'll understand why. No, he but yeah, I'm gonna go to the stupid. They break someone's heart at the end because it's you know the first thing I brought to my mind when I think of middle school relationships. Let's see where we land. We submit our results and we are September. That's actually pretty close. That's actually very very close to what it actually is. It's October second, you know. So September is a month before October, which is which you calculate that. That means they got uh, 11 12 close to my birthday, which is. Hey, I mean, I gotta do math. That's 91% close to the, the actual birthday. 91%. So this this survey is 91% correct because they're one month off. One month off. But hey, that was a pretty good. That was pretty good. You know, that was pretty. That was pretty good guess. Pretty good guess right there. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. Um. So yeah, like I said before, you know, <laughs> 19 years old. It's crazy, man. You know. Um. This next year is gonna be a crazy year. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting done at TCC. I'm gonna move to UNT next year, and I'm gonna get an apartment. Most likely, with Michael, we'll, it will see what happens. Hopefully, that actually works out. Um, if not, then fuck. <laughs> but yeah, uh, so once I get an apartment next year with some of my homies, I'm going to be making a lot of videos and there going to be a lot more, you know, I could be a lot more louder because I am right now in my bedroom and my parents are downstairs. So it's kind of, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of fucked. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, it's your boy, Film Slice. Uh, thank you guys for everyone that said happy birthday to me. I appreciate every single one of y'all. Um, yeah, thank you for everyone that subscribed. I'll see you next video. Peace the fuck out. Ash, get it! <laughs> it's your boy, Phil Slice. How is this? This is good old quality of audio.
grab for air like asthma, yeah Hate in the street, not pass him, yeah Lock me up in a phantom, yeah That boy sick, he got cancer, yeah Pull up in D and we flood it, yeah Lock that boy in a dungeon, yeah Headhunter, I'm hunting, yeah Spit fire like a dragon I think too much, school fucking suck